I have acquired some free stuff today. Uh, we have here a Jensen CD player clock radio. And it works good at most times. I already have a CD in it, so... There's the radio. The volume is somewhere there, it is. Okay. Let's go to CD. Oh, yeah, there we go. This works when it wants to, and then doesn't work when it wants to. Typical. And if it gives an error, It'll show E in the display. <laughs> so far, it's not one to play because it's a piece of crap. <laughs> I can hear it trying. Oh, for Christ's sakes. Of course, now I want to do a video, it won't show me. There it goes. And of course, it has to be Cindy Lauper. Oh well, this one isn't too bad. It's from the movie The Goonies. It's a good movie too. Now it wants to work just fine. This volume is very touchy, very scratchy. So yeah, that is that. Then we have, yeah, so that's basically, I'm not going to show anything else of this. It was free. Uh, you know what? Hold on, where's the model number? I always like knowing the model numbers of these things. JCR 600. All right, so that's the Jensen JCR 600. This is a beat up RCA um, stereo or boombox. Uh, yeah, this doesn't have the original speakers, and it's pretty beat, and I don't even know the model number on this one. And there's no handle, so I can't pick it up, it's so annoying. Oh look, it's manufactured in 94, which it is. Is that the, that can't be the model number over there on the bottom right hand corner. I don't know. Oh, wait a minute. Never mind. Model number RP7975B. All right, well, the C player, I don't even know if it works. I don't have it hooked up to any speakers. So, oh my God, so sticky. I can hear it spinning. It's not now. It's not flashing CD, so it must have read the CD. <laughs> yeah, that's a loud mechanism. Wow, and it's missing the forward search button. Um, but yeah, as for the tape player, I don't know. Let's find out. Fast forward works. Rewind auto stop works. Ah, play. All right, good. Er, what's funny is earlier this wasn't spinning, so something must have caught in gear. What's funny? I don't. Even, what's funny is I don't think that uh, cap stand wheel thingy for the pinch roller. I don't think that's uh, secured in place because earlier I could just take the damn thing and I can just push it and it would almost go all the way into the hole that it sits in. So I don't think there's a, one of those little locking locking brackets on it or whatever, but oh well, we don't have to replace the belt. So that's good. But yeah, so. So that is that, that this is definitely a uh, beat semi piece of junk, <laughs> but it'd be still cool to see if the 
tape player plays and records good. And then this. This is a 1986 General Electric color, tel color television, obviously. Um, and I do have the remote. Cable channel table. Wow. Hmm. Well, my phone's not focusing on it too well, but yeah. Had to tape this because the door doesn't stay shut. I think the piece that hooks on in there snapped off the door, but little itty bitty speaker, like tiny speaker. I'll uh, slowly get the tape to peel away so I can open up the door here. There we go. Not gonna go too far because the carpet's stopping it from. Eh, it must have fallen off track. No, it's the carpet. It's too fluffy. <laughs> anyway, uh, you got your holds, your color, your tint, sharpness, brightness, contrast, TV or cable, and TV and video. Which, when I press that, you'll see a little light down there for video and now it's on video mode and earlier this cord here I tested it with a PS3 <laughs> yep a PS3 on a 1986 television and uh, it, it 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 worked good the speaker I think is shot though it has really bad sound I don't know what LCV means but yeah the mute works actually all the buttons work the volume no, the channel ones are touchy. I think the channel down one was touchy. But if you push forward, it auto searches. Even though there's nothing hooked to it, that's what it's designed to do. Hitting down, which it worked this time, auto searches. So in order for me to stop it for now, I just hit volume. That stops it. But yeah. And I just hold the thing closed. Yeah, so. Yep, a 1986 GE TV, an RCA 1994 boombox, and I didn't check the date on that, but obviously it's newer, so yeah. All right, well, those are my freebies. All right, later.